All right, what's up? We're back with more of uh, Bully. We're gonna get ready for class here in a moment. All right, I don't know what class we have first, but we'll eventually get around to it. And then I will do the prep challenge and also, uh, I have kind of pushed it off for a little bit, but that's okay. We have a football right here. You cool? What's cooking? I wanted you to catch it, not just stand there like a, like a, oh, good lord. So it's a shop class right here, so we're gonna head there. All right, kids, I'm in a crap mood today, so just shut up and get to work. All right, you're getting somewhere now. All right, X. Good work, Hopkins. I guess you're not useless. Okay, see you next time, Jim. Damn, I'm good. You unlock the new BMX. And done. Oh dang, a big fight starting here. He's like one of the toughest uh, preps too, so we'll see how this goes. There's a lot of griefers right here, but I don't know. But we'll see how this goes. Okay, that Grazer got knocked out. All these Grazers and they, uh... Dang, he has a lot of health, too. I would go to class, but I want to see how this goes first. in the class. I just wanted to see how that fight turned out. Okay. Photography Welcome too. Back, everybody. I hope none of you forgot your cameras. Do you want 
All right, take pictures of students for the yearbook. Okay, so that was easy. You know, Jimmy, you have a little bit of a rough edge, but I really think there's something special about you. All right, you can now take photos of students for the yearbook, which can be found on the pause menu. All right, so, so far we have Jimmy Pedia. Uh, Russell. Those, those, those are the ones you unlock by default. Now, uh, click leaders, uh, you can gain in a couple missions, but for the most part, they'll automatically be added as, uh, as, uh, after their respective, like, boss fights. So you don't have to worry about getting those taken. And Photographer 3, by the way, won't unlock until you get into Chapter 3, by the way. So don't worry about having to go to Photographer 3, at least not in this chapter. Since it won't unlock until uh, Chapter 3 is open. In the meantime, let's do the Prep Challenge. Try something. All right, so you can block, oh, dun, dodge, win. or punch. I sort of just go into this, just spamming the punch button anyway to get it done with quickly. It's definitely not an overwhelming challenge at all. So I thought I'd just go into it spamming the punch button anyway. That's all there is to it. I like that Pinky is still supportive of Jimmy, even, uh, uh, they only went on, like, one real date, but she is supportive of him during all these fights anyway. That's cool, but like I said in the last video, I think they could have done a better job with, uh, character development and also, uh, and giving us the option to, like, hang out with people more. Just some free roll. I'm done. All right, I won. Give me my prize. Hmm, there's a little problem. Your parents have to be members of the board for you to be eligible. Tell you what, old chap. We'll give you that old abandoned beach house. Should be nice once you clean it up. All 
All right, you passed. You've earned the beach clubhouse. A new save location unlocked. You've earned the boxing outfit. So yeah, it looks like a pretty chill place. I wouldn't mind hanging out in there. Uh, why am I still my camera? All right, I'm actually gonna go ahead and do some more boxing here because you get extra punch damage from doing this. And that is very valuable in the game as a whole. Everyone is a hater of Jimmy, Jimmy except for uh, Pinky in these matches. I swear. It's a wonder Hopkins is still standing. We want blood. Another job well done. All right, let's do some more. That's the best you can do? Man, shut up. I... That's the best you can do. <laughs> Whatever. I hate that uh, the dialogue uh, will repeat after a certain point after you played for a long time. Get a little bit more extra punch damage. Yeah, they really should have made it where a uh, job well done. Where the dialogue just cycles uh, every time instead of just stop at one and just repeat that line because that tends to be frustrating. Him the hell out. 
Okay, so yeah, if you want to continue boxing them for money, you can do that, but we're just gonna move on here now. You know we can't associate with you until you wear some proper clothes, huh? All right, you need an Aquaberry sweater. You can buy the Aquaberry sweater at the clothing store in Old Bullworth Bay. Hey, get the hell off my bike. This might be useful. Hello. You know you should try the new Aquaberry vest. Very popular with the better class of students. You'll be the talk of the town with your I new was garments. Just looking for Goodbye. one of those. The Aquaberry store is pretty expensive, so we're just gonna stick with the uh, uh, buying just that for now. But we will definitely be back to that store as we progress through the game. In the meantime, let's go ahead and uh, do the next mission. The eggs. Look, there he is. I was wondering if you'd show up, Hopkins. Nice Aquaberry sweater. Trey Sheik. <laughs> yeah. Wow. You look a bit like my gardener at home. Yeah, so what? Yes, well, enough about uh, gardeners yeah. or any domestic help. Listen, me and the champs were planning a little revenge hit on old Hattrick. We don't like what he did to that old Soak Galloway. A chap could have a drink if he bloody hell wants to. So? <laughs> so, my friend, are you, as they say, in? Sure. Are you English? Well, no, I just speak this way because I'm very insecure. You see, my father is a self-made man, so I pretend to be old money, but in fact, I'm really nouveau riche. But less about me, dear boy. Listen, we're going to egg that old codger's house. Cool. Smashing! You go get some eggs and meet me and the chaps back at my house. Buy some eggs and take uh, Tad's house. If by some chance you would uh, you already had some eggs, then uh, uh, you would uh, you would just go straight to the uh, straight to Tad's house. But I didn't, so we're gonna take uh, the eggs there. the eggs, Hopkins? You bet. Then give them to me. Take them. Smashing. Now tell me, Hopkins, is it true you said I was inbred? No. Because first cousins is legal, my friend. Legal. Yeah, okay. Yeah, and just because my elder brother doesn't have a chin and ended up in a lunatic asylum, it doesn't mean anything. Whatever, Tad. Your family is your business. Don't lie, Jimmy. You said Tad was probably a hermaphrodite with that much inbreeding. A hermaphro what? Don't act dumb. You said his mom was also legally his aunt and that he probably had webbed toes. I don't. Well, just only on one foot. Tad, you're not gonna take that kind of crap from this scumbag, are you? You've, you, you've been rude about mommy. Let's get this, Papa. Gary always, <laughs> Gary just had to start something, right? But yeah, look at the extra punch damage I got from the from uh, the boxing. It's gonna be no problem at all. Don't whine. That doesn't hurt. 
here can't wait to tell you can move i have a key shut up give me oh. that key why did you have to do that don't you wish i might need that i'm still richer than you eggs are now available in your room to look what's behind you. Okay, so as we can tell now, our preppy respect is now at 35%. The only one who still likes the style of preppies is, uh, is Pinky, though, because we have already kissed her at this point. So you know what, since I earned it, let's go ahead and check out my uh, uh, beach house over here. I'm frightfully in I bet you can't beat my swimming record. You just don't have the poise. Yeah, you have my gratitude. All right, swim around the booby, uh, uh, the, the, boo the buoy and back, my goodness. <laughs> My bad. Uh, swim around the buoy and back. Jeez. That Freudian slip, though, right? I love how he gave me a task, even though uh, they pretty much hate me at this point. We unlocked the tiny swimsuit, which we're pretty much never going to wear anyway, so. Better collect that. I wish we could get a health bonus from Pinky, but it's going to be harder since they're now hostile to me, the rest of them anyway. But yeah, here's what the, uh, what the, uh, what the prep clubhouse looks like it it's pretty cool i mean i wouldn't mind hanging out here i mean you got a microwave back there you have a radio playing some jazz music i think elevator saw me whatever the hell that is uh you got frat paddles on the wall here and you also have an arcade game this is, of course, the Future Street Race game that you can play. Uh, beating it, by the way, is not required for 100% completion. It just gives you something to do. But some of the other uh, arcade games are going to be worth 100% completion. All right. With that in mind, I'm going to go ahead and save the game right here. But I'll see you all soon with the next part of Let's Play.